What up, people? Welcome to this week's episode of the Book of Bra. What up? So yeah, last week's been absolutely mahoosive. Mental. Uh, Mental. Followers on TikTok went up by like over double. Um, demographics changed massively as well. We used to be a seventy-eight percent male, twenty-two percent female following on TikTok. Now we're sixty-four percent female, and whatever the other percentage is for the male. Yeah, dang. Do whatever that quick maths did, bruh. Bruh. But doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Massive thank you to uh, yeah. all you guys that are watching and um, just just helping out, making us feel that little bit better. Ah, oh, it feels good. There's so much positivity in the comments. Yeah. Like, so, some of the stuff that people have been saying is so nice. If you haven't seen it, just go through the comment section. Yeah, it's jokes. It's funny. It's good. It's yeah. good. Uh, everyone's been, everyone's been pretty pretty kind. Yeah, and we're nearly up to a million views. That'd be the first one for us. But, but, uh, sh sh should I say now, like you know, apologies if anyone's offended by anything that no, I, I th gets said. I, th or I think. Like that, or well, maybe have people accepted what we are. I, I think they they sort of know that you have no filter, but also that you're you're learning, that yeah, you're growing, uh, yeah, you're developing, yeah. and you. But most importantly, you're listening. Um, I, I I tried to. Well, we both tried to. <clears throat> yeah, yeah. I, I I learned some stuff in that list and any of the other list that we've done. And um, it's just been nice, man. It's nice. I, 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 think, I, I think this whole like li like listing that we're doing, and even for like people that are watching and stuff like that, listening. However, you get this. Mm -hmm. um, it's actually quite nice to see because, like, reading these lists are pe other people's opinions and views and blah blah blah, whatever. Yeah. Yeah. But like, this is just like, oh snap! This is actually other people's views. Like, someone actually got someone. For Valentine's Day, a stuffed animal. That's crazy, yeah. That is mad. A plush raccoon. <laughs> that is, that is, if I was going to get a taxidermy animal, that would probably be one of the ones that's like up there for me. Well, unless it's uh, like a pet raccoon that you once had. No, I think I think having a stuffing a dead pet, <laughs> someone that was part of your family, is a bit weird. Well, why stop there though? Yeah, why not just do you, you, stuff your grandma? Yeah. Yes. So, My mum passed away last week. Yeah. I've got her like gun fingers in the kitchen. <laughs> no way. She's she's sat in the living room with a gun gun trigger finger just ready to go. And I got my dad just asleep on the sofa and it freaks people out when he just never wakes up. No way. No. He doesn't say hello to no one. He's just stopped. Just shake, shaking him. Imagine he's just like shaking him so hard on the, sho oh on the shoulder. He's just like, he just doesn't wake up. He's, he sleeps like the dead. <laughs> but, but you could probably get like some sort of like competition going just for jokes. I wonder if that's hundred pound if you can wake him up. Yeah. While he's fucking stuffed and dead. I wonder if that's legal to taxidermy people. <laughs> oh Surely not. No, of course not. There man. can't be. But man, uh, bro, I went to you know what? Yeah, I went. I, I, can't, I can't remember if I've told you this or not. But I went. To, um, I'll, I'll throw the location in um, the video, or whatever. The bio. Um, I went to well, so I it, 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 it's it's um, advertised as an animal museum. I was like, oh, okay, cool. It sounds right? nice. Yeah, so it sounds fantastic. Yeah. So like, okay, cool. Went there. So it's in Tring. So Tring, it's called like Tring Museum or something like that. Um, Tring, and I was like, oh yeah, that'd be quite nice. You know, go check out love love animals and that. Yeah. And bruh, this place was <clears throat> messed up. House of Horrors. It was so bad. What was inside? It was just. Just everything was just like yeah taxidermy. Oh. Everything was dead. Was it was it just normal poses or did they? Yeah yeah yeah. It up a bit? No, no 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 no. There wasn't like <laughs> yeah like gorillas like in some fancy. <laughs> no chimps <laughs> <had their laughs> handling an AK forty seven. Yeah yeah, yeah it was none of that. That'd be cool. Like, it, was, it was just freaky, bro. Mm. It's like two or three levels of just everything dead. Levels. Yeah, bro. It, they had everything in there. Everything. So it was like House of Wax, but with it, animals. It was bad man mm. it freaked me out I, like you know it, it took at least like half an hour to get there there or something like that and i was in there for about five minutes i was like i didn't honestly leave this is freaking me out i was like, like like when i saw gorillas and you know like polar bears and lions i was like okay i know this happens or whatever yeah but then when you go you keep going then there was like a whale a stuffed whale a whale a stuffed bro this one saying it was it was like this like oh this is a bit creepy this is stuff, something not right about this um and then sounds kind of cool but yeah. what Topped it off, there were stuffed cats and dogs. I was like, nah, I'm, I'm good. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm out of here. The exotic stuff, you have a reason, but I see cats and dogs everywhere. Yeah, yeah, exactly, yeah. Why is that hedgehog there? <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Why is yeah. that fox there? Yeah, well, well, what does Sonic ever do to you, man? Where'd you get that pigeon? Oh, God. Um, but, bruh, I, I thought we should uh, change it up this week. Okay. So, because 
for the past few weeks, <clears throat> it has been a bit negative. Um, Perhaps. Or, well, actually, maybe not negative. Maybe yeah, yeah, negative yeah. Is not it's, right. it's not ho- like wholesome, just yeah, good yeah, yeah, vibes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Solely good vibes. Exactly, yeah. Okay, yeah, cool. um, So I thought I'd change it up and we'll, we'll go through the top 20 things um, of the nicest things to say to a friend. Wow. And, and do you know what? Yeah, I, nice. I, I, I have nice. thought. I have thought this. I, I have random um, urges to say nice things to me. Yeah, 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 yeah. I oh, do. for real? Well, yeah, no, one hundred percent, bro. Oh, cool, man. One hundred percent. And and it's it's so true. Yeah, that not. And, and and I'm sure you'll probably agree. Yeah. People don't say nice things to their friends enough. You rarely, rarely compliment people. Yeah, it's, it's, especially like guys, guys with their whole like emotions are yep. are locked in a safe, deep underground guarded by raccoons but you like you think like a lot of people are going through shit yeah absolutely and why not let's let's be nice for a day let's do it so welcome guys welcome welcome to a nice episode of the book of Bra. Book of Bra. um so so the first one to, apparently so so the top of the list mm-hmm. um i thought we'll work our way down um and and bra if someone's if someone said this to me that i that well anyway i'll just say it okay you are more fun than anyone or anything i know including bubble wrap wow in it the, the the bubble wrap adds a little bit of extra <laughs> yeah 100 percent context my, and and what, me, what got me thinking was my mum was obsessed with bubble wrap she had a weird obsession obsession with bubble wrap Gr- all, like growing up all i remember is just whenever we got something mm. and it was bubble wrap she'll like she'll yeah. fight you for it. She's doing her thing. Oh yeah, yeah. She'll just she'll, she'll she'll steal there. it off her kids. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hundred percent. Yeah, yeah. Some, yeah she'll something. just yeah. sit there watching TV, just popping bubbles. There for 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 ages. Um. So yeah, I mean, if it like you are more fun than anyone or anything I know, including Bob Rap. Uh, bruh. Thanks, man. I don't think that's the one for you. I, I no, no, I, no, no. I didn't say it to you. No, I know. Yeah. Okay. Well, I, I say, it's well, like, you, if, you said thanks. No, like, but if somebody said that to oh, me. Oh right. Okay then I feel like, are you dying or am I dying? <laughs> that's the sort of thing. <laughs> What's happening to you? That's, that's Something bad is going to happen yeah, and you'll you get, look you're getting some nice last words in to clear your conscience. Yeah, yeah. But, uh, th- that's not the one that I want to say to you. Okay. M- m- maybe when I go through this list, I'll find the right one. Okay, yeah. And then we'll I'll find s- it. Hey, I, I, and I'll find the right one for you. Yeah, yeah, thanks. Okay. Bro. Thanks. Um, and I'll say it genuinely. It won't be, um, you know, a little side. Yeah, heartfelt. So, yeah, it would be, yeah. Nice. Uh... Oh, you know what? Yeah, you are the most perfect. You that you okay? I see the way this is a bit of a tricky one to say. Mm. You are the most perfect you there is. Oh, that's nice. You're the per you, you're a perfect version of yourself, bruh. Thanks. I like you held eye contact while you said yeah. that. Well. <laughs> it's just weird. You don't need to point out. <laughs> it's tender. Yeah, and bro, you know what? Yeah, this is the wit. This is exactly what I'm saying. Is why is it so hard to get like I, like I'd give compliments to a woman easily. Yeah. Like, just I'll freaking make it rain on them, bruh. Yes, but, absolutely. But we don't say it to each other. We don't say no, it to we other men. We, 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 don't, we don't say it to other men. Um, you know what? Yeah, bruh, this is... Um, say it to me. This is the one that I'm saying to you. Okay. Number three. Ooh. Number three. You are enough. Wow. That's so backhanded. No, bro, it's not. <laughs> That's so bad. No, it's not. That's the one you're saying to me. I am enough. <laughs> you, no, you are Explain enough. Explain yourself. Because I feel like you're 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 very conscious... I am, yeah. Yeah. You don't need to be, bruh. Don't need to be. You are enough. I'm enough. You're enough. I well, might be. Like, well, like, have you burnt those trousers that I took the piss out of? They've, they've been thrown away? <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah. So I, I, this is what I'm saying. Are they enough? You, you, no, you, you are enough, bruh. Okay. You don't need to be worried about anything. Okay. That's nice, man. Thank you. you. Know, do you I mean? appreciate that. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So that's, it's one of them ones, yeah. One it's not a backhanded one or nothing there. Just generally. Okay. See, this is why you can't say stuff to men. Because like, do you just fucking insult me there, bro? <laughs> yeah. Was that? Do you want to throw just, hands? <laughs> yeah, just knock me do you out. Do have a fist fight? <laughs> um, I will never say this one to you. Oh, no. Sorry, not this one. Uh, so number four. Oh, I'll still never say this one to you. Because okay. you're too big-headed. Uh, you are one of the strongest people I know. I probably am. <laughs> Probably, <laughs> that's exactly why I wouldn't say it to you. That is that is literally yeah, exactly. Hey, right. Don't say such accurate things to me. All right, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> no, yeah, no one wants yeah. to hear that. No one wants to hear that. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Um. I'll also never say this one to you. Um. This is oh, man. I'm trying not to make this negative, but it's now turning this, into. This just, is why it's, it's so hard to say <laughs> yeah. nice things to guys. Um. You look great today. You probably need that actually. I look great every day. 
<laughs> see, you just don't need to do that, bruh. No, <laughs> no, I mean, no, to be fair, watching some of these podcast episodes back, I'm like, oh my God, I need a haircut. I look like a homeless man, rah, 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 rah. Yeah, you, you so, say um, a lot. But I do look good today. I do look good today. Do You, you know, when you Fuck, say that, do you actually believe that? I do, bro. I turned so <laughs> many heads on the way here, you know. Fuck, man. There's so many people looking at me. Bro, you know what? Yeah, I wish I had that. Do I wish I had that sort of confidence? I don't know. Uh, it might just be because I had my flies undone or something like that. But oh, I was, yeah. I was turning some heads. Bit of, yeah. Yeah. Might have been the person behind <clears> you. It could have been. Uh, it, it could have been like the 20 kilos worth of camera gear that I was carrying along with <laughs> yeah, me. Yeah. And some guy walked out of a restaurant <laughs> and like I couldn't move around him. And then he stopped around. He was like, oh, sorry, mate. Whoa, are you working? And then oh, just carried on walking. I was like, yeah. Porn shoot. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm a That's exactly what it looked porn like. star. Yeah. I've got fucking four <laughs> tripods over here. <laughs> a load yeah. of light equipment. <laughs> yeah. You can only see two tripods at the moment. He's got a big carry bag full of baby oil. <laughs> um, yeah. I, 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 would, I would like to think like you do. But but to be fair, bro, I'll, I'll give you this. You have changed your swagger a lot. Thanks, man. You've changed it. Like, like what you green trousers, like green chino type trousers on today. Mm, go on. A black champion thing that you've been bigging up for Trendy. so long now yeah well, it's, it's, it's it's good yeah. it's good thanks um, man thanks it, I, I definitely was low on the fashion oh side of things. bad bro you was really bad, bad yeah really bad. but anyway um number six you have the best smile i do <laughs> bro i'm not saying this <laughs> no to you. no all right sorry, <laughs> sorry. This, cool. this is not just top cool, 20 right. things to say to tom i just i just know <laughs> I just, I just know that the room lights up when I smile. <laughs> That's all I can say. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> well, I guess maybe without saying any names, who, who would you say has got uh, the best smile out of your friends? Is there someone that you know? Out of my friends, yeah. Um, I would say it's, it's probably we're probably allowed to say her name. She shared our story today. Oh, oh, she's got an yeah. ear to ear smile. Ki oh. Kira, you've got the best smile. 100%. Kira. You vanilla queen, ray of sunshine, beautiful. You beautiful do, you life. do actually light up the room, and yeah. you're and you're hella funny. And we're getting you on here with you, like yeah. it or not. <laughs> Bro, we're an ally. We can't say these things. Anymore. Oh, oh, yeah, sixty-four what, percent. We're an ally. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. No, but yeah, no. Hey. Yeah, but if I had one, left, <laughs> okay, go on. Um. Oh, this is a nice one. Number seven. Your outlook on life is amazing. You definitely I wish someone you, could say that to yeah, me. Yeah, 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 you yeah. definitely can't take no, that one. No. no way can you take that one. No, they'd be like, you should improve your outlook on life. Yeah, you do You do need to. Stop looking through those depressed goggles. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, no, you. hey, but, bro. But then, bro, your outlook on life is amazing. Thanks, that, that's bro. a genuine one. That's one I'm going to say to you. Yeah, thanks, bro. Yeah, My, I, yeah, I think I've said that in another way, but yeah. Thanks, hey. bro. Thanks. Appreciate it. Nice. Um, oh, no, I feel like my outlook on life is pretty It's great. Good. Yeah, I'm actually very jealous of it. You, you have said that before. I, I would steal it off you. Yeah. If thanks, it was, man, If thanks. it was physical and it was something I could rob, I'd <laughs> Okay, all right. Anyway, come on. Uh, yeah, we'll call them swiftly moving it's off getting, on that getting one. violent. <laughs> um, oh, and and maybe back, back to Kira again. Okay. Uh, number eight, you just light up the room. She, yeah, she, she, pretty, she pretty much does. I reckon you do that to a degree. You, you, t you, can, turn oh, up, you can turn up a room. Bruh, you know what, yeah? That yeah. is one thing that I will, I will be so... Uh, big headed about you're pretty I, I know I can you're good at, to have at parties for uh, sure yeah yeah if, if you're feeling low and you're feeling depressed or something like that just come see me bro you could walk into a tea party with the royals and walk out of like bro they'll be UV crunked rave. up yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah everyone will have like glow sticks on them uh, Harry yeah. will be like this is what I've been waiting for my whole life <laughs> yeah, yeah literally bro the, the, the queen will come back she would come back for it she would she but would I won't let's not go there yeah let's not I, I wasn't pee. yeah um Number nine, you make a bigger impact than you realize. That's nice. Bruh, that's one for you. Thanks, man. Bro? You, you make a bigger impact than you realize. I'm going to I'm gonna be rubber on that one and bounce it back to you. <laughs> I'm rubber, you're glue. <laughs> <laughs> no, you, oh yeah, you do, man. You've been really good to me. You, you have been good to me. No, no, no. I mean, as in like, like, like with your job, yeah? I, even though... Um, mm. It's a job. It's a nine to five. I it won't is, go yeah. into much detail about it. Mm -hmm. But you might you you make a bigger impact than you realize. Yeah, we yeah we have a very uh, the good thing about my job is the mission that we have and the jobs that we do. Yeah. No, no 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 no. I was bro, I was thinking the other way around. Oh, the things Th that I do for my job. No, think about the 
think about the amount of kids that that that, that oh you, yeah, that yeah. You make happy. We, we do bring a lot of joy to a lot of families and stuff. There's yeah, a, exactly. There's that, a lot yeah, of social and environmental benefits to what I do. Yes, there is. Yeah, and you yeah. will never know. You will never know. No, unless but, you like and subscribe, and then I can quit. <laughs> yeah, 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 true. Yeah, and then I'll do a tell all. Yeah, then everything will get laid bare. Mm. Um, you are always so helpful. Number ten. Yeah, you're pretty helpful, bro. You have your moments, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, no, no, you're a good man. Yeah, no, yeah. no, no. We're, you, you are, bro, you, you've helped me out loads. You helped me out. Loads. You've helped, helped me out loads. Well, help me move in, bro. I did. That was yeah. a, that was a big one. That was a, that was a good fun job. Yeah, that, that I was. I love a, a bit of manual one. labor. I almost died that day. <laughs> you um, did your face. Yeah, your exactly. Face when yeah. I turned up, that was bad, man. I was I was a broken man, bro. You looked like you would had a baby that's been crying <laughs> for three days and you haven't <laughs> slept since. It was, I was, it was so like desperation. Oh my god. Uh, number 11, you have the best laugh. Well, I, I'm going to start flying through these a little bit. Yeah, go. Number 12, I appreciate our friendship. I appreciate our friendship. I bro. do, bro. I do. I, I, I do appreciate our I, friendship. I think I ever think... since lockdown, I've appreciated it more. Yes. Because yeah. I, yeah, I, yeah. I, I think everybody was a bit like business as usual, just got running through the motions before bro, lockdown. 100. And then lockdown made everybody stop and think about stuff and really it appreciate did. their friends. It did, definitely. During Zoom calls, but then not seeing them and then coming back together. Yeah, and, and I think yeah, that, yeah. and this is what that's where this podcast came from, it, bro. It did, you know. Like, these I, conversations are so and, fucking good. Let's put them on the internet. I, I actually had a conversation with someone the other day, and was it as boring um, just compared to ours? No, no, no. So, so, so what I actually it. said was, um, so, so, so the other day, so the other day, uh, uh, like and subscribe. I'm not sure if it's hundred percent up yet. <laughs> yeah, the uh, Book of Bra Gaming <clears throat> channel. Uh, we haven't set it up yet, but by the time you watch this, it's going to force me to do it. So, <laughs> well, no, 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 well, well, if it, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's coming anyway. Yeah. So keep an eye out of that. Mm -hmm. we, we, we like playing games and chilling out. Of course and, we do. You know, go, going out of our comfort zone and stuff like this. And, 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 and what I was originally saying, bruh, was it was actually nice. Like the other day when we was playing GTA. Yeah. Cause usually, or, and, and even when we play Rocket League to be fair, but whenever we link up, it's for business, isn't it? It's true. Like obviously it's nice seeing. Yeah, each yeah. Other well, after this, we're gonna have a nice chill out. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. But it is like mainly orientated about B business. Let's do, life. let's do some business. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Let's build an empire. So, so, let's so, take so, over so, the world. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, uh, w w which is still very enjoyable. Love doing 100%, it. Yeah. And obviously, in, you know, here's another compliment for you, bruh. Enjoy doing it with you, bruh. I enjoy doing it with you, bruh. Yeah. Um, I shouldn't have licked my lip before <laughs> I said that. I had dry lips. <laughs> <laughs> I won't say anything, bruh. This is why it's so hard to say compliment. Yeah, then. exactly. Yeah, this is. It's like, is it confrontational? <laughs> yeah, yeah, Are you coming on to me a little bit? <laughs> yeah, There's an agenda what, here. What, what, what do you want from me? I know you want something. <laughs> yeah, like, the, way, the way you just licked your lips and Yeah, no, nah, dry lips, bruh. Dry lips. It's yeah. been a long old day. Yeah, I've been I'm a, a drink, bruh. Yeah, I'm going to yeah, get gonna, a bit flustered. I'm going to wet this whistle. <laughs> but yeah, nah, bruh. It's, it's, actually, it's actually nice to um, like play games and stuff like that. Yeah, man. It was, it, was, it was a bit outside the. The business area. Yeah, true. Even true. though I love doing this. Even though we're going we're gonna to start a business in GTA as well. But. Oh, 100, bro. Little gun Oh, man. Armor. You, bro, I've already been been setting stuff up because... Did you play without me? Bro, I've got a surprise for you. It's not it's not one of them ones. Don't worry, kid. Hey, keep an eye out on that gaming channel. Yeah, yeah man. We're getting global, cuz. Look at bro gaming. <laughs> yeah. Um, oh, number wait. 11, you have the best laugh. Nice. A, you, and you know what, yeah? I, I love people that laugh. Same man. Bit, bit, it's like, infectious. It's so it's infectious. You. When when you have a hot woman mm. who has a nice personality, uh -huh. is banging, beautiful, nice body, you know, and 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 you know, let's not trigger people. When mm. I say nice body, I don't mean I hundred one hundred percent don't mean like a uh, supermodel. Like you know, yeah. when they're like, I don't, I don't want to say you know, like when they're like size six or whatever you want to call it. I don't know, like yeah. really slim. That's not me. That's not a nice body for me. For me, they need to... Ooh. A subjective nice body. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Something different for everyone. Yeah, exactly, yeah. yeah. So, I can't even remember what I was saying. I've gone off. Know, I'm thinking about... It. Something about a laugh and a oh, sexy Oh, yeah, woman. that was it, yeah. Yeah, when they've got a nice body. And nice then, body. Oh, and, then, they, and then, then they're laughing and joking and stuff like that. Yeah. Oh, fantastic. But to be fair, on, on the backhand, uh, what's her name? Audrey Plaza? 
Oh, yeah, she's got right. she's got those like dead eyes, and she's miserable. But I love that as well. I love because because when those when Audrey those Plaza. when those girls smile, the ones that you have to work for that smile. Yeah, those yeah, are the ones yeah. that light up the room. No, but uh, uh, man, Audrey Plaza is just so fantastic. She's a very saucy bean. Oh my god, she's a zesty lemon. She is so. Oh. She, she she was one of my one of my top five last year. Oh, nice. I haven't, I haven't 2023 we're only in February I'm yeah, not yeah. sure about my list yet hey you got a whole year to set but, the roster yeah you are exactly yeah. yeah so but I'm sure she'll probably still be up there you know yeah anyway um, getting back to it so the nicest things to say to somebody nicest things oh this is beautiful your inside is even more beautiful than your outside oh that's a bit rude isn't it I think uh, the intention couple, is nice like maybe 20-30 years ago before the internet corrupted everybody that would have been really yeah. awesome but now yeah, it's yeah. like you've not penetrated me <laughs> You don't know how tired I am. <laughs> <You're>, what? <laughs> What's that got to do? No, you you're, bruh. You're inside. You're, as in like your heart, bro, not your... That's what I'm saying. I'm yeah. saying that, it corrupt, that we've been corrupted. <laughs> oh, right. Hey, like, I, I, don't, I don't think like that. <laughs> yeah, no, like, your, your sugar walls are better than your face. I knew you were going to say sugar walls <laughs> as well, you know. I knew you were going to say it. I knew you were going to get that in somehow. That's what, that's what you was basing. That's what you said. It doesn't mean that. It means as in like... I implied heart, that. Bro. I did not say you're, yeah, you're, a, bed, you're yeah, a vagina. Yeah, exactly, bro. Anyway, yeah, let's move. We're allies, uh, bro. Anyway, move, about this we're, we're moving yeah. on. We're moving allies. on. Um, this is a beautiful one. You just glow. That's nice. So, some people do just glow, you know. Mm. There's, there's, there's this... I'm, I'm not going to mention her name, but there's this one old friend of mine uh, and she just has this mad glow about her, you know. Nice. Like, like she's just always seems happy, smiley. Mm -hmm. People that are around her are always just like, like just happy and about themselves. I get that. Not, there's not many people like that. You there's know? not, there's not. Um, but she, she does just have this glow. Beautiful. Um, number 15. I love the way you bring out the best in people. Cute. That, that, is, nice. that is nice. That is nice. There needs to be more people like that, I think. Yeah, I think we bring out the worst in each other. Uh, nah, bro. W worst and the best. Depends on when the camera's yes. on. Yes. And it depends on how many drinks we've had. <laughs> yes, sir. That, that yes, is sir. <laughs> that is the main uh, problem. Yeah, that's the catalyst. Um, oh, okay. So R blank um, is better because you're a part of it. And the blank means like, um, like our, our, beavers. Our club. podcast is better because you're a part of it, bro. One of those type of ones, yeah. Nice. Church, nice. school. Um, Workplace, something like that. Dope. Um, yeah, very nice. Uh, you inspire me. Oh my god, bro, that would be one of the most fantastic things if someone said that to me. Or if someone said that to me, that would be. Just, just, I think I just. I, I, I think I, I would probably be fighting back tears. I'd be like, yeah, yeah that's cool, man. Yeah, yes, yeah, same, Bridget. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm much yeah. loving it. See less. <laughs> I beg you, see less. <laughs> <laughs> oh, something just got in my eye. Oh, I'm allergic to I, I it. I just need to go take a shit. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh my god! Is someone? I don't think anyone said you inspire me. Uh, like you, you, you might have heard it. Maybe like I don't know. Like you know, like if you're oh, bro, I think somebody did say that to us. I, I think. I oh think my god! That um, that, that there was a, there was a mum that said oh. In the, oh, in the comments, God, she yeah. was like, I think it's so nice that you boys are doing this list. And I did see that. You're going to be a really good inspiration for young men. She didn't yeah. say that we inspire young men, yeah, yeah. but she implied you that could we could be. Yeah, <laughs> we we could might be inspire her son. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's, it's true. Well, even, even that guy we inspired. Which guy? Um, the one who said that he wanted to lose weight and stuff like that. Oh, yeah, Brad. Nice. Yeah. How, how's that going? Hopefully you're still uh, watching this and stuff. This is just, this, this little section here is just for you. For Hope you, you're well. Hope you're still killing stuff. And just, just being the better version of you. Right in. Google Forms below. It's in the bio. Yeah, let us know how your journey's going and stuff. And everyone, let, let us know how your 2023 is going. Right in. We'll read it out. We're on the, what, second month now? Second month. Almost third. Ooh. And, but actually, it's probably a good time to mention, mm. it, it's your big birthday this year, cuz. Oh, God, don't mention it. And I'm going to keep mentioning it till we... Um, until I turn 30. That's what you're trying to say. I did, well, I didn't want to put it out there, but uh, it could have been uh, your 21st. But. Uh, oh, yeah. How old do you think I look? Probably, <laughs> actually, don't. <laughs> it, it, no, I look good today. Do it. Oh, my God. Don't. Don't. Oh, my God. Don't <laughs> oh, judge God. me. Judge me. How old? What? Do I look good? No. What? Why? No, today I probably look old. But if I shave, no, I, no. Can, I can be young. <laughs> I can be young again. Oh, God. Anyway, come on. Anyway. Nicest, nicest things to say to somebody. 
Uh, is it penultimate? Like semi final? Yeah, yeah. Nice. Uh, number 19, nothing can stop you. Not sure if I. Oh, that's. Thought. Nothing can stop you. That'd be such a power move. I'd be yeah. like, I'm in, I'm invigorated by that comment. Nothing can stop you. Nothing can stop you. I feel like I'm just about to go to war or something. Yeah, exactly. I like yeah. it. That's, that's yeah. good mm. energy. Yeah, just let's go. Go fuck someone up. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, something like that. Um, and the last but not least, you, you've you made my day. That's a good one to end on. Oh, oh yeah. hello. Um, you've made my day. That's that, and, and, and that's probably... Um, a perfect one to end on because I like how how I was saying is I think I'm sure we've said it in a, a few episodes of how important it is to be kind. Yeah, hundred percent. Being kind is so and 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 this is like especially with all the shit that's going on in London and stuff like that. Yeah, hundred. Yeah, it is. But it's a war zone at the moment, and it's like all all, all these little oh. like kids and stuff. They're yeah. kids, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. yeah. They're teenagers, kids, blah blah. blah. Just, just be kind, bruh. Just be kind. Just uh, and and what's actually quite, have you seen those things on Insta where people are like all, all these hood man them and they're like all like dressed like dressed how they dress hood look and then they're like well, hey hey we have you got money on you you got money on you and then they like you, oh you don't have money well here's twenty I, I, I have seen those guys and I think if they came up to me I wouldn't enjoy it even yeah. even <laughs> even for the twenty quid I'd be like thanks <laughs> yeah. my legs are shaking. I'm yeah. going to stagger away now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'll try. <laughs> I, I, was, I saw one guy though. He, um, like they all stopped him and he was just coming back from work. He had his headphones on. He had like a colorful shirt I've on and a black jacket. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they came up to him and he looked around and he like done his jacket up and he just went road. And he's like, yeah, I'm doing good. Yeah. What are you saying? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was like, respect. I'm not sure I'd act like that. Cause there, there was at least like 11 guys. Oh yeah. But you got, yeah. And also, I'm yeah. white. I know that I can't outrun them. So it's, it's just either... <laughs> you, you haven't got speed on them. No, nah, it's just like, well, I'm going to try and negotiate my way out of this well, situation. The, yeah, the only thing is you've got people that will help you. I do. Yeah, that's, 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 one, that's do. one good thing that, um, yeah, be, being a Caucasian uh, helps with. Um, yeah. Well, uh, what are you saying this week then, bro? So I guess you've been seeing all this stuff with UFOs getting shot down in America. In yeah. America. Yeah, I've uh, I've I've, I've been, only seen like a little bit, like something like three unknown objects were. I think it's like four or five now. Oh damn! I think part of it's probably people just sending up balloons for a laugh. Apparently, yeah, but, bro, one of them. Come on, man! Yeah, they keep on saying they're spy balloons from China. Uh, China apparently say yeah. that they're weather balloons, and then yeah, you you saying that spy thing? Do you see how that guy got um, arrested? Was he the part of the? CIA or something like that. CIA. And, there's a, and there's a video of him. He he ended up being a Russian spy. No way. Yeah. And, and so there's a video of him like recording like this screen. Mm. And but but it's like, you know, like one of those old school screens where you're like, there, there's stuff on this computer that yeah, yeah. people don't want. You know, when they're like boxy and Yeah, and it's like green writing. Yeah, yeah, one yeah. of them ones. Yeah. And he was recording it and I think he yeah, he got sacked because he was a Russian spy. It'd be so much fun to be a spy. It would be uh, fun. Very nerve wracking. Yeah. yeah, massively nerve wracking, but it would be super fun. Mm. I, I don't think there's a, I don't, I don't know where I could be. You could be a spy. I think I, I, yeah, I could blend into a lot of places. If I get a tan, yeah. I can look quite, um, like not, not quite Asian, but maybe like Turkish sort of thing. <laughs> I, I could get into that sort of zone. And also I think I could be quite a lot of European. Anytime yeah, I walk could... into like a Romanian shop, they always greet me in European, uh, in Europe, in Europe, in that European, <laughs> they they greet me in the euro. Yeah. Then, <laughs> they they throw the euro at me. Yeah, but um, any sort of like that's I, I don't know. I think I can blend into quite a lot of places. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, you, I, I you're can't very blend. distinctive. Yeah, I can't blend in. You, you can't even go to uh, you know Clacton on Sea without. Oh my god, Brad! Did I tell? I, I I don't know if this is one for the podcast or whatever, but um, should we make a note of thirty minutes? You're yeah, about yeah. to say something dodgy at thirty minutes. Uh, so I got pulled over the, the other day. Okay. Did I tell you? I, I don't think I told you about this. No, you didn't. And it's it's fine <laughs> in some ways, <laughs> but these police officers are racist. Okay. Um, the, Go on. The, the, give us a breakdown. So I was driving on the motorway. How fast were you going? No, no, no. All normal speed limit. All that okay. sort of stuff. I'm not victim blaming here. I'm just. Yeah. I know you. No, 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 no. <laughs> no but I, I I drive slowly ish. No, like I, I always obey, obey the speed limit. It's just I get there fast. Okay, yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like, I drive erratically down and again, yeah, but I never 
go crazy on the like motorways and stuff. You never break the law. You just bend it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. one of them ones. Um, but but this time I, I like I was technically against against um the law or whatever. Uh -huh. So my, my number plate was just day. And okay. I know that, and I know they're clamping down on it or whatever. Fair. But I was driving someone else's car. But oh. I, I, but I, I have the insurance. Uh, my, my insurance allows me, allows me to drive any any car that I want, uh -huh. whatever. Um, but when they pulled me over, they they pulled me over and said, um, "There's not, um, there's not a um, a man registered registered insurer to drive this vehicle." And I was like, "Oh, okay." Um, yeah, I was like, "I've got that insurance policy that allows me to drive every other car," um, and I was like okay, well, we're pulling you over because we can't see your number plate. So I was like, so how do you know that when I'm not insured to drive this vehicle if you can't actually see the number plate? Yeah. In it? So yeah, I was yeah, like, no. Oh, dang. And then, um, he, yeah, he, he threw me in the back of the car. Uh, well, he didn't throw me. He asked me to step into the back of the car. Or okay, yeah. Um, let's not, like... Exaggerate. Exaggerate a little bit. Yeah. Or anyway. Um and yeah, he was just like, oh, so your name, blah, 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 all of this. And this was the worst bit. And uh, like, to be fair, this might, this is, I'm sure this is going to trigger people or whatever. The worst bit was, mm. is when he's taking my details down or whatever, he just assumed my ethnicity. Yeah. And this is what, and, and I didn't get, oh, what did he put down? Black. Yeah. Do you know what? All of my mates think you're black as well. Yeah, I know. Yeah. He, he, he and, and he's just like, Oh yeah, Ju Julian surname, blah, blah, or whatever. All my address and everything like this. Yeah, ethnicity black. And I was like, whoa, whoa, whoa I'm not black. Um, and he was like, yeah, but you look it. And I was like, ooh, in it, a lie. But, but and, and this I was, like, police officer should know better. Yeah, and I was like, thinking like, oh, he probably shouldn't say. He put, he probably shouldn't have said that. Probably shouldn't. Uh, and it got me a little bit. A little bit on the defensive, a little bit. I don't, I don't, because that raised my blood pressure a little bit. So just, I, I, just a I little can bit. See why, yeah, bro. But, 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 but I get it a lot, so I wasn't too yeah. thinking about yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and yeah, he, so he was like, yeah, you. Well, well, you look at. It, I was like, but, yeah, but, but I'm not. I'm not. But I'm not. Um, and he was like, okay, so, so what do you put down? I was like, I usually put Asian other because yeah. I'm not like typical, your typical Indian, but I'm also not thinking. So he went to Asian, and then he then he selected Chinese, <laughs> and I was like. I was like, I was like, bro, I'm not, I'm not that Asian. I was like, do, do I look that Asian? I, and 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 then the other officer that was in the car actually started laughing, <laughs> and it, like he was kind of like he was kind of casual because he was just like, yeah, he was like, yeah, he's he's not Chinese, is he? <laughs> and I was like, bro, I'm clearly not Chinese. I was like, just put a, just put Asian. Yeah. He's like, yeah, but it doesn't specify it. I was like, yeah, but I'm clearly not fucking Chinese though, am I? That's that's even further away from the truth. Even further. <laughs> it just doesn't that's, make sense. Yeah, it's pretty far, yeah. It's, 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 I'm, I'm assuming a lot, uh, technically, a lot further away from black. You, you had more more chance of, oh yeah, he's, but it, you know, if someone else pulled me over and said, oh yeah, he, that's Chinese Julian. <laughs> it's gonna, that's not going to make any sense. <laughs> no. <laughs> but, it sounds like this officer was like, you know, the apprentice, um, a builder's apprentice or something like that, just a bit of a dumbass. Oh, he, he he's he, he asked was, him to go get a wind hammer or something. He was like that. yeah, yeah. He was so dumb. Damn. Even when he was taking down my email address and stuff like that, yeah. I was literally like, yeah. and then he messed it up, and then he had to go back delete. He then pressed the wrong button. He had to re-enter the details. Damn. It was it was a whole shit show to be honest. Um, I'm not sure what police um, like borough they were because I was on the motorway up north somewhere, um, but. Mate, you're, hey. you you was wrong for that. Um, I don't, uh, hold my hands up for the for the um, offense, the, the actual offense of the number plate being uh, dirty. Or it whatever. wasn't your car. Well, it, first it wasn't my car. Not and your then, responsibility. Yeah. Well, and you know when you've been driving for a few hours, you can't you you, you can't sit like you know what you're supposed to do. Pull over and clean your number plate. Yeah, I can see it in somebody I'm, else's car. I'm not doing that. Yeah, work exactly. Yeah. So um, you right there, bro? Yeah, I got really tight hips, bro. <laughs> yeah, shit, mate. Yeah, I'm nearly thirty. Yeah, yeah, damn. Nearly thirty. But well, anyway, yeah, yeah, that, yeah. That's yeah. So yeah, yeah that, that's why. Yeah. Well, I, I wasn't steering the conversation towards. Um, that is crazy though. Yeah. I'm, yeah. That I know. Yeah. That, that's crazy. We went, went on a bit of a tangent there. Bro. Yeah. No, but um, yeah, it's good to hear. It's good yeah, to hear. Um, um, yeah. So yeah. Well, yeah. You, these UFOs. Well, well, yeah. I was just going to talk <laughs> about how some of the some of the UFOs initially it was like a balloon, but then other ones have not been described as a balloon. 
There's one that was like a car shape. Yeah, I heard one. What? There was like, there's really weird shapes on them. Swear. Yeah, one, one of them was like an actual saucer. And, yeah. and in the statement that they did on in the press conference, they were like, are you ruling out extraterrestrial UFOs? They, and, they and never they said, do, bro. And they said, no. Yeah. I suppose it's one of those things where it's not a 0% chance, but uh, that, that's crazy. There's, there's that dude, I, I can't remember what his name is, and maybe maybe this is why we need other people on the podcast, because... Um, they know names. Uh, yeah, the, the, some some people have a lot of a lot more knowledge about this but there was this one guy who used to work for what's that place called in america nasa no the other the alien place oh area 51 yeah there was a pe- person who do you know who what he's called and then he was on no. like he was on like uh, joe rogan's podcast and describing everything of course he was um no shade in joe rogan but no but yeah like he grabs everyone and yeah this dude basically said that they i mean obviously area 51's there yeah. everyone knows what it's about yeah um well everyone thinks they know what it's about yeah but well it is about that isn't it what do you mean it's just an air base how no. how, how fucking how terrible would it be to have all the the stuff in area 51 surely you tell it like you let everyone think oh yeah it's an area 51 actually it's an area 52 Whoa. Well, think about it, man. Think about it. I do think that there is. Um, yeah, but you can't even get onto it, bro. As soon as because you... it's an air base, you can't go onto any military base. Well, no, you can't. No, no. Try and go to RAF Northolt, and they'll yeah. treat you very unnice, hostile. I guess. Yeah, yeah. yeah no, well, uh, bro, I believe it anyway. Okay. Do, what, what, do you believe there's no aliens? Then? No, no. I believe that there is aliens, and I, I, I believe that they would cover it up. Firstly. Because... Apologies to any any being that's listening. Yeah, um, I, I don't pre- particularly like the word alien because Do you think it's a bit derogatory. It is a little bit, isn't it? Extraterrestrial. Yeah, extra. Yeah, extraterrestrial. Yeah, yeah. That, that might be a bit better because technically everything's an alien, isn't it? Yeah, there's there's like alien invasive well, well, no, species. I mean, like stuff. a dog. A dog's an alien technically. How? Because it's 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 not part of our um, nature, isn't it, or something. It's not part of our. It's not part of the human race. Yeah, it doesn't make it an alien. So, what makes something alien? Something that's different to the human race, right? No, um, I mean alien. Oh, something. Gotcha there, something. Bro. What's it? They Come call... on, Marcus. Oh, I don't. I don't know. I don't know. I was going to have to get the old Oxford dictionary. Out. <laughs> yeah. I don't know something that's not from. It's not like indigenous. It's not from where it originally came from. Oh, it's not from this. Yeah, so like parakeets. Oh, okay. I guess they would be considered aliens because they are... Parakeets? Yeah, you know the parakeets around London, the yeah. big, the green ones? They're yeah. not native to the UK. Some They, uh, they well, either got go. let out of a bird shop and then they just started breeding and now they're all super saying, inbred, but yeah. all over London. So technically they're aliens, bruh. Yeah. And even like, isn't like like starfish or something like that? I'm sure they're... I be. don't know, yeah, but... Um, yeah, I, I fully believe that there is I aliens. Do. And I, I think do. it does make sense to cover it up. I'd love to know in our lifetime... But oh, if they, be amazing. if they did tell it everyone, I can just see religions breaking down because like there's nothing in the New Testament to say, <laughs> yeah. you know, it's like God made. Yeah. And on Sunday he said, "Let there be light," and then, the um, and then he light. also did that like everywhere else. Yeah, and there's a, a lot of religions don't really incorporate that, so I think there'd be a huge breakdown of that. True, um, and, when, and when religion goes, they, uh, that's a uh, yeah. That's a shit show then. Bro. Also, it'd just be hard to control the people, you know? It's, yeah. it's going gonna, it's gonna to crash the economy. Yeah, a lot of people will go wild. They'd be like, so what, is platinum not super rare? Does everyone have platinum? Would 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 you be bothered? No, I'd be would, super excited. It wouldn't change but, the way, where, what I do. <clears throat> why, would you, why, why would you change? I think it would be... Apparently, it's not good news. Why? Because... We can learn so much, bruh. But it, it depends on if they're friendly or whatever, I guess. Yeah, but you can say that about anyone, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. But, um... Dep- I mean, if... Uh, to be fair, I'm, like, yeah. imagining a nice, friendly type of looking alien. They could come down and end up being, like, 20 foot tall with, like... Yeah, you're... you're razor blade Yeah, hands or it could be like War this. of the Worlds. You know, it could it just could, be yeah. zapping people. But they, they yeah. do say there's, like, the, the Fermi paradox, which is uh, looking yeah. out in space, we should see life everywhere it should be with the amount of planets and stars yeah, that exactly. there are that, bro, that's what there I'm should be life all over the place but yeah. it's not and um there's this cool youtube video on kurtzgart i'm not saying that right 
but it talks about the great filter and they think that civilizations always get up to a certain technology and oh, that's what might wipe them out before i think yeah 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 so so like this one like of the reasons why we might not be seeing them is because every civilization gets up to a point of development where they hit a technology whether it's like ai or nuclear or yeah. something like that that inevitably wipes them out before they can become a space yeah. race yeah so bro what do you think about all this ai stuff uh, i was gonna say ai scares the shiz out of me bro mm, that really is a scary. bit of a worrying tech i don't think we should make anything that's smarter than us like no shade on any ai no. listening because i know you i know you will listen to this oh, one day 100. and i'm all for you yeah right? like hey, I, I robot evil overlord no, hey, good Overlord. Yeah, Whatever you want to be um, called. Sorry. What was that? What was that film with that with that fit robot in it? Um, is it Scarlett Johansson? That one? Uh, it's not Scarlett. Yeah. Who, Scarlett who's Johansson. in it? Is it like? Oh, it's that model lady. Oh, oh Sophia. Uh, no, no, no. I know the one you mean. Ex Machina with. Uh, um, yeah, 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 yeah. I can't remember her name right now. But good film. Good film. So, so, so if if, if an AI like that is. You know, wants to holler, then... Hey. <laughs> hey. Have you ever seen Her? Her. It's got Joaquin Phoenix. And huh. I think it's also Scarlett Johansson. No, Where not. they just, they bring out an AI on a phone and then he gets into a relationship with her, but she's only on oh. only on the phone. But, but well, that's the thing, And they right. just have such good communication that he's like, do you know what? I am in love with you. And then, yeah. and then they, and they sexed hard. Oh, She's like, I want to fondle those bars. She and then, um, yeah, it all develops. So it's a really good film. Really good film. Yeah, I mean, uh, if, if have you have you seen that Chat GBT? I've not actually looked at it. Do you know what it is? Yes, bruh. Yes, I I, I have um, uh, investigated it. Oh yeah. And what I thought would be great, and we'll we we'll, like try and get this to work, is we could do an AI episode. That'd be cool. So, 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 ju- like, cool. not not one hundred percent sure how how this chat GBT works or whatever, but it's meant to be like. Have you seen it work or anything? I've I've seen that people have said that they wrote essays and they've passed. And oh stuff yeah, like yeah, that. yeah. That's uh, mine. That people have done mad things with it. But before it was regulated, you was able to ask it for anything and it'll just give it to you. Nice. Like, can I have the plans for a for an assault rifle and it'll just give it to you straight away? Oh no. Yeah. So, oh so, no. B- because it knows everything. It, yeah. It, it it literally can tell you everything. It it doesn't know people sp- like specifically. Yeah. So like if I knew like if I asked asked it um, give me information about yourself it it, it, it might more. know about Elon Musk but wouldn't know about the general yes yeah population. Yeah, yeah. The, yeah yeah exactly yeah that's good so 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 if we um it'll be, but it'll be nice to see if if we if we could get it to just script a whole hey, episode just, just be a guest yeah just be a guest yeah. Script a whole that episode. would be mad. That would be cool. We should do that. Yeah. What, to which one? What your one or my one? What are, your just, one? Whatever yeah. you just said. Scri- yeah. So I was thinking to script a whole episode. Yeah, let's do that, man. But that sounds it'll, sick. It'll be kind of cool to see if it if it could be a guest. I guess it could be. But, but it would just have to be a laptop here or something like that. Just. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe we could that. bring it up to an emoji or something like that. If if it had well, if ChatGPT had a. It might. I'm not sure if it does, but probably doesn't. I don't think it has a face. Yeah, does it have a voice? It might. If it, if it, must, it, it must have a text to speech. Yeah, if it had a voice and a face, that will be nuts. Nuts. People would 100 percent start falling in love with them and stuff. Yeah. Then I. Then I. I wonder if it could talk day. I, I did see. Oh my God, I might have to check this out. I, I saw there was an AI the other day that they said recreate party photos for like a house party. And oh, they oh. came up with these ultra realistic. Oh ones. my days! That was yes. insane. I could not believe that that was fake. Like no one, and, no one had a real face. No, and they were like normal, pretty good-looking people. God damn, dangerous. Bro. I mean, think about the the deep fakes and the porn stuff that's going to come from that. Though. That's dangerous. If it could come up with like HD realist, oh, right? Imagine that you could like you'd be like, I want to see. You show me a video of ideal. me smashing this person. Yeah, you. Well, yeah, you could give the most the, your most ideal pornographic situation that sounds so dangerous oh my god that, that sh- that, but that's the thing how do you control it yeah I, I just don't think we should make anything smarter than us and i don't think nah. we should create anything nah. that we can't control because well uh, have you seen the thing maybe not like maybe not smarter than us it was just something like but but chat gbt is already 
sort of smarter than us. Oh yeah. If it, if it had the free will to choose what it yeah. wanted to do. Yeah. And I think Goog- free will. Yeah. That that's the main bit. Yeah. There, if right? it was conscious. And I think Google. Yeah. Uh, Tom Segura has a really good podcast where he got a guy in from Google who claims that an AI had already gone conscious oh, yeah. and they were doing tests on it and he's saying and he's speaking to the ai and the ai is asking like oh you need my consent yeah. before you do these sort of things yeah. and they do these tests on them where they're like the, the only one that i remember was him going like oh you're a piece of shit i just don't think you're good enough they're probably gonna have to get rid of you yeah and then the ai was going like oh my god i'm so sorry what can i do to appease oh. you and stuff like that and it was like showing emotion and distress from yeah, how yeah, he yeah. was treating it yeah and then but they just worrying, but they'd it? done like 20 other tests like this. And in the test before, they'd said, like, oh, I'm gonna do this to you and blah, blah, blah. Do I have your consent? Yeah. And then they wipe the memory log so it doesn't remember any of that. Yeah. But then they keep the memory logs. And sometimes they go back, but they don't oh, always show oh, them all oh. of them. But imagine like one day it gets access to all the memory logs, and he's like, Have you been degrading me like this? And that and that's where and that's when it goes iRobot. Yeah. I, I just uh, I don't know. It does scare me. I think I, I saw a clip of Elon saying that it's very dangerous. Although I think before he said it was cool, so I don't know. But mm, yeah, I, I, I feel it like makes AI, me very nervous. A, a, AI definitely makes me more nervous than aliens. Um, yeah, I, I don't know why. It yeah, probably I th- shouldn't. I think aliens are going to be kind of chill because because imagine cool, the way yeah. that we like, say like uncontacted tribes in the Amazon. We don't go over there and just yeah. start like showing them stuff because yeah. it will end up like when the um conquistadors the spanish ended up going oh, to well, yeah. america and, yeah. the, and there was a massive outbreaks of smallpox mm. and syphilis and stuff uh, and the germs just started killing off all the indigenous so surely they've got some sort of protocol there where they say we're not going to just directly contact them yeah because they'll freak need... out and die yeah, well I, I i feel like like aliens probably look at us and think these guys are pathetic look look, look at them really? like driving around and w- walking <laughs> are those fossil fuels yeah what, what the what idiot they're, they're in a vehicle that can explode yeah that don't make sense it doesn't make sense no we, 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 and, and when you think of it like that yeah it doesn't make sense but, no i do think that yeah. it's probably like the ultimate petri dish and they they i can imagine that they would still come but yeah i think there's definitely rules to say let's not just go kick their door in yeah exactly yeah yeah there's, 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 a, there's gotta be the, the, oh, what like a like a council like a higher council I think, sure, so, yeah, there's surely got to be like a little so union, cool. like a EU sort of situation between yeah. oh the... Oh my God, that would be sick. That is so cool, bro. D- oh my God. If there's any aliens listening, I, I, I can oh, see... Please it, let me be a representative. I can see it on Anchor, actually, which is the... Uh, what? An- what, what if aliens are watching? Yeah, yeah. yeah there's a... <laughs> bro, that would be mad. There's a, a feature on, on Anchor. It's the Spotify break-off company oh, yeah, for like, yeah. uploading our audio stuff yeah, yeah yeah and you can see on the audience um geographic locations yeah but it's not going to say like mars <laughs> it does that'll be it doesn't flip and say mars it does bro. bro it says countries wow there's a lot of countries there yeah it's, wait if, it's if you do be... no bro if you do it on the computer i promise you it, it says like mars and stuff does it yeah it's still zero really disappointingly but oh, it, oh, it only oh says, right it actually says different planets yeah Oh, snap. I imagine if one day it went to like 0.01. Oh. Whoa. What's Whoa. That? Oh, that would be mad. <clears throat> bro, when people move to Mars, it could go up. Bro, I, I genuinely think I should be a representative for this. Yeah, if there's any aliens listening that want to Please. do a Guardians of the Galaxy kind of situation, come kid- chat to us. Kidnap me. Yeah. Don't even ask. Don't no, get consent. Hey, this hey, is hey. consent. What do you mean me? And then we'll, we'll get him as well. No. Get us while we're filming. Us. No, no, Us. Stop saying that. Sorry. Uh, sorry. <laughs> I'm just thinking about me. I just want to go. Just yeah. take, take me. Yeah. Take me. God. Jesus Christ. How badly you want to be a prisoner. I know. I'm such a simp. <laughs> I'm such a pick me for aliens. <laughs> God. Um, anyway, bruh. Yeah. A little bit of question time, sir. Is it that time? Okay. It is that time. Well, Oakley Doakley. Le- th- th- this is where we need something like, <clears throat> question time, question time. I'm sure that, you, okay, if you put your mind to it, we could put a nice we, little we, graphic we, in We there. could do that. Right, should we look at it for a sec? Cool. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Question time. Question time. Oh, Question time. Nice. Um, so, this is a, a relevant one, we'll say. We like relevance. Dear the Book of Bra, mm. after months of scrimping and saving, mm. I'm gutted to discover my husband to be has blown £1,600 of our wedding fund on eating out and designer clothes okay okay i was so angry i outed him out on facebook 
about it, and now the whole thing has gone up in flames. He doesn't seem to understand how damaging this is. I am 32. He is 25. Okay. But Interesting. Be- Interesting. At, well, but he behaves like a selfish child. I told him how irresponsible he was, but he walked out on me because I went public. He hasn't come home for two nights. <laughs> he hasn't come home for two nights. Oh, it's like he's punishing me. I still love him. I think he might be. <laughs> I still love him, but can I get him to be more responsible? What should I do? Okay. <sighs> he's 25. You, what you got to remember is he's 25. He's 25. He, he's on the back How end. Old is he? 32. Th- th- 32. Yeah. Is I, I can 25 tell 25 is. As a 25 year old man, I was, I was peak. Peak reckless. Peak reckless. Because you, yeah. you got adult money. Uh, you've got a job. Yeah. You, you've got some experience behind you. And you sort of know a bit about yourself. When you're 18, you think you're a big man, but you're not. Yeah. And you try and act like a big man. I started realizing you, that. Yeah. When you're 25, you can you can go anywhere. You're, yeah. you're not too old to go into clubs and you're not too young to go into bars. Yeah. You can, you can sort of live the life and... Yeah. And... and <sighs> I mean, he's twenty five. He's twenty five. He's twenty. That's the big thing. Yeah, and and I think I think late. Not, not that that's and it's like a, a, no example. shade on any twenty five year olds, but well, well it's, you're, no, you're, but it's not even like it's not it's not a, it's not an excuse <clears throat> to be reckless like that. No, but, but it's, it's what you expect from that generation. But I think she's putting no, no. It's not a generation thing. It's uh, when I was twenty five, I, I probably would not have been at a place of maturity because I think women yeah, but you mature would, I, a lot earlier oh 100% but and you wouldn't have I, I, I sort of you, you wouldn't have spent £1,500 on designer clothes you not, would have, you would have went tra- travelling yeah me personally I spent all yeah, and, but, but, but that's but what I mean would by I, generation would, would, I, would I have spent um, oh. if the situation was reversed <laughs> when I was 25 would I have spent that money going off to Japan or something yes and I did that <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I did do that yeah yeah, um, yeah true, true. regardless of marriage or whatever um, so yeah everybody spends it on what they want to spend it on yeah designer clothes and eating out sure I, I can see why it's not my thing but I can see yeah. why people do it um, but yeah I think he's 25 he's 25 <laughs> and, and uh, uh, but, but that's yeah. what I mean by this generation now mm. a, lo- a lot of hey, hey a lot of our audience are that age so yeah but, but you're great you're great you, you know what yeah but you you are fantastic but yeah, realistically you, you make my day i i i still i still, still i couldn't justify spending like uh, over 1500 what, pound on clothes over what time frame if it well if it's the wedding fund it wouldn't be that long maybe what yeah, two years or something yeah but engagement exactly over two years 1600 and eating out and oh and right food. Oh, i mean yeah it depends right. on time oh, frame saying, sorry but but yeah, really. Um, I think you're putting him. You're 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 probably comparing him to what you were like when you were 25. Yeah, which and is girls, different. girls mature at, by 25. Yeah. Girls are a lot more mature. Yeah, than guys. I'll, I'll, guys I'll, are I'll, still living like they are young. Oh, 100. And I think we stop maturing at 25. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah. Ment- I've, mentally, I've, I've, mentally, I've always said the prime age for a for a guy when he starts realizing what he really wants out of life yeah. and what he what path he should be going down and wants to go down blah blah is 27 yeah if, when every guy I, I feel like every guy that I've known as soon as you hit 27 your life just kind of changes it changes it does when, when you're on the wrong side of 25 and 30 is not yeah. that far away yeah. I think you start to realise like you know what I've got to stop being a boy and I'm a man yeah 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 like I'm, I'm a man now yeah uh, I still don't feel like I'm a man though. No, nah, I think I think yeah. In terms of maturity, I'm still like 25, but yeah. I, I, I think I, I'm I'm supposed to be a man. Yeah, I, I don't I'm know. A, if... I am a man. Well, I'm a man. Yeah, but I'm not a big man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah but, big man. Like, um, but I'm not. I'm, I, I wouldn't like you know when you see like like adults and they're like, oh, yeah, go go to the pub for a cup. Like yeah, I, yeah. Like they seem like adult adults. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Oh, do you want to come down. around for a cup of tea? Come, come, come around for a cup of coffee or something. No, I don't like that. Yeah. I don't like no, that at don't. all. But hey, we're those we're just those those sort of guys. Maybe when you're 30, it might be different. Nah. Yeah. But I, I think, yeah. Think he's about, not gonna change. He's not well, he he's not gonna change right now. Invest a few more years in him, and I'm sure he'll be a good man. Remember yeah. all the good things that made you start getting with him. Yeah. And 100. also remember what you were doing when you were 25. Yeah. But actually, actually, no, remember what you were doing when you were 22, because that's sort of the 
oh, equivalent, yeah, yeah. I think. Oh, smart, wedding. smart. Yeah. The buffer zone. The buffer zone. Yeah. Um, yeah. And I hope it all goes well. It's probably... Yeah. Uh, like, like I said, invest in him. He, he's, he, he might be worth it. And the key bit is, I think, yeah. is he, if, he, if he really wants to marry you, yeah. he will definitely change. Yeah. Uh, but also, I, I do think it's um, oh, yeah, flip it's only eight. fair to say that you're wrong for putting it on Facebook. Yeah, oh, 100. You shouldn't have had him like that. No, nah, no. Nah, that, that's... Uh, uh, Being be, be an adult about dirt, Dirty laundry in public is never yeah, a good idea. Never. And also, a man's ego is very, very fragile. Yeah. So, um, in front of his friends and family, potentially, don't know what your friends list is like. But... Um, al- 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 although he... I just, I just thought maybe we need to see it from the other side as well. Okay. Is, is that like... He 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 spunk this money. Yeah, I'm guessing behind her back. Yeah, yeah. Get rid of him. Get rid of him. Okay, play the other. Yeah, Get, bro. He's he's that's some serious disrespect. Cool. If you're twenty, if you're twenty five, do it with your own money. Don't do it with a wedding fund. I'm assuming. I'm assuming oh, with the wedding fund. I'm assuming that it's like a joint savings type if of it's thing. Something like that. That is bad. If, yeah. if he's spending your money, yeah. If he's spending your money on just designer clothes, and stuff, first I apologize. Yeah, yeah I get, apologize. I was get get your money back, and you need to <clears throat> stick him in, get, get him in a ring. You and him go at it. Mm. Like yeah. that's that's rude, bro. Yeah, that is so so rude. You can't you 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 can't be st- like you. A lot of people don't have respect these days, bro. Wedding fund. Mm. Yeah, you're right. If, if it's a wedding fund, it's going to be joint, isn't it? Well, uh, I don't. It might not be respect, but it might just not be appreciation of the consequences. Oh, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, but, but yeah, and it's a, it's a lot in it. You, but still, that's a tricky sh- one. Yeah, shouldn't have put it on Facebook. <clears throat> he shouldn't have spent the wedding fund money. Yeah, he is only twenty five. Listen, everyone's got a mother hen sort of friend, especially in the ladies' yeah. friendship groups. Ask her; she knows what to do. Yeah, she's wise. I, I still think you should just yeah get bond rid. that. Yeah, but bond that. Get rid. He ain't he ain't, he ain't shit, son. No. Nah. If, if he's doing that, oh yeah. If he's doing that about your wedding fund, man, just man's a joke. It's very naughty. Very, 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 very bad. Um, All right. So thanks for that. Uh, we would love to hear what other dilemmas or anything like that you lot might be having. In the bio below, you're going to see a Google Forms, completely Google. anonymous. Ooh. Write it down. Let us know. Any sort of stories, dilemmas, problems, rah, rah, rah. And we will read it out on the podcast if it's juicy. What uh, One bit of news before we go, bro? Absolutely, sir. And this is kind of, kind of big at the moment. Okay. Um, have you seen... That that girl who's come forward claiming to be Madeline McCann. I saw that briefly, but I didn't click on it. What what went down? She so so she she hasn't given. They haven't given out much much details about who she is and stuff like that. Because what the, the reason I'm guessing the reason why she's questioning in the first place, she must obviously not know her parents who her parents are. But she's got the same sort of eye marking and stuff like that. All right, but it's it's. So where's she been? What, what what I'm thinking is very rude, but all right, uh, fifty nine oh three. You're about to say something. No, no, I'm not, I'm not. I'm not going to say it. Okay. I, I, and and I'll, I'll I'll stick the I'll stick the picture up here. Um. So that so like yeah. so 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 let's so have, so, so, so you guys could see the p- picture of her when she, so she's a teenager now. Yeah. Um. And I just I just I just don't see it. T- to me, Madeline McCann looked quite angelic and. She looked like, I don't know. Before she was a kidnap victim. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Like yeah, that. well, of course she's going to look angelic before she got kidnapped. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The person that kidnapped her can't exactly be the... <laughs> I guess so, yeah. Oh, damn, that eye marking is like It, it, is, v- it is very similar, bro. Has she always had that? Yeah, yeah. I suppose I've never, like, looked deep into her eyes, but... <laughs> no. That is crazy. No, that's very, um... Could it be? Could it be? I don't know. I don't know. I mean, obviously, I she was know. really young in that big photo that everybody knows and now yeah. she's a lot older yeah but apparently um, this girl's now done a DNA test but I just I just, I just don't think so and, and what the results are pending yeah resu- results pending I would absolutely love it if she was because I need to know it, I, I need to know what happened to her because yeah. I was sure that her parents killed her uh, yeah I, well maybe we shouldn't get into that because th- 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 that would definitely get this show cancelled I don't know yeah it's just the, it's the whole thing I don't know if you watched the documentary but they threw the fridge out 
It's like, I, I think you and me at our most drunk couldn't wreck a fridge have... so bad that we had to get rid of it. Oh, God, no. No. Well, so I, that for me, it's just like, why'd you get rid of a fridge and why are you being so shady about it? But uh, And, and the, the, there's that, um, yeah, I don't know, the whole Epstein thing, but... Yeah, we wh- wh- whatever, We mate. should definitely not go Whatever, mate. Okay, um, my news. Yeah, have you got anything for me, bro? Bro, I've got some super cool news. Oh, do you? All right, try not to freak out. Okay. Giant seven-foot sword and mirror for demon slaying found in Japan tomb. What? Yeah, bro. Holy shit. Yeah. There's a lot of words Why in here. Why would you tell me this, bro? I only found out today and I was oh like, this is perfect. God. I'm seeing I'm seeing Jules tonight. Oh I'm my filming God. tonight. Have so, you got a picture of it? Uh, yeah, it's not great. Obviously, it's like a super old sword. So it just kind of looks like an old shoddy rod. But, oh, okay. but it's pretty oh. cool. I mean, that's the guy's arms out there and it goes for a, a little while after. Wait on this. Well, that's a... Whoa. That's a sword, yeah. So yeah, seven foot sword. Uh, it's going to say a lot of. I'm going to say a lot of things that I can't pronounce, and it's going to be really bad for any Japanese people watching. I apologize. But they How were. How big was that guy wielding that thing? Bruh. So it's in an area near Nara. Uh, they found it in November last year. They announced it in January. It's going to be put out into the public around Nara somewhere, and um, okay. it was created in the second nice. half of the fourth century AD. It was buried in clay near the center of an ancient tomb. And I have to get the size of the coffin up. So the first major discovery came in the form of an enormous five meter, which is 16.4 foot long wooden coffin. Oh, and then, what? Yeah. Who has a coffin a, that a, big? A 16.4 foot long coffin. Holy. And then it was, and then the buried in clay and covered the coffin. And then they found the huge iron sword and a shield that was shaped like a bronze mirror. Dang, what a don. Bro. So, um... Oh, getting buried with that sort of... Yeah. That's that's like bossy shit. That's legitness. That is... Oh. So all the uh, conspiracy people are going to say that it's because there used to be giants and stuff like that that used to roam the earth. Yeah. But I don't think anyone's physically capable of living if they're that tall. I think the tallest man on earth did have massive circulation problems. So, I mean, whether you want to say giants are a different species or whatever, but they, what they think it is, is it was more of a, uh, like, uh, a ceremonial sword that was used in the afterlife, you know, something that you're buried with, uh, for battling Oni, which are demons in Japanese and Yurai, which are ghosts. And then the sword was meant to, uh, reflect bad energy and bad juju. Makes sense, bro. Um, Makes sense. But I thought that was incredible. That that is incredible. I, 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 like maybe we've evolved. Who knows? Maybe maybe was, maybe we were once twenty foot people. I think no. I I think back in the day in Rome, say everybody yeah, yeah, yeah. everybody on average was a lot shorter. Everyone used to be around five foot tall. Oh, okay. And because of like dietary stuff and I guess just oh. general evolution, we've mm. lost a lot of hair and we've gotten a lot taller. Yeah. yeah. And so. I think and appara- maybe back in the day when somebody just got a freak gene where they end up being seven foot tall, they were like, oh, that's giant. And apparently penis is getting bigger. Bro, I was going to say that. It's, it's gone up by like 2.4. It's like 24%, bro. 24%. Hey, hey. what a time to be alive. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what a Everyone's time. getting taller. <laughs> yeah. Everyone's getting less hair. Everyone's dick's getting bigger. Everyone's getting lengthier. Ugh. Nice. And nice. on that note, guys. I think that's a really positive one to round yeah. off on. You guys are beautiful. You're the best thing that has happened to us. You inspire me. You, you inspire me. You inspire us. You're my reason for getting up in the morning. You are. You are. 100%. You are a sunflower in a field of daisies. Exactly. Exactly that, bro. Could, yeah. Couldn't have said it better. If you've enjoyed this week's episode, say one of those things to somebody. Yeah, man. Compliment someone. Yeah. No, like, like, share, subscribe, all of that sort of jazz. Yeah. But... Yeah, so, like yeah, shout out some love to people, man. Yeah, spread the good vibes. Yeah, peace and love, people. Peace. See you next week. Peace. Peace.